high school students are gearing up for ball season, but for one South Auckland school, they're also trying to keep costs down. James Cook High School in Manurewa have set up a ball op shop thanks to donations from the public, where rather than buying something expensive that you can only wear once, students can hire a special outfit for the big night. Our reporter, Laura Tupo, went for a look. In a room at the back of the school, there are clothes racks filled with dresses and suits. There's jewellery and shoes for the girls, makeshift dressing rooms, and a guarantee that those wanting to go to the ball will have something to wear. Year 13 student Ashley Balvi says the shops open to students at break time. We've set it up that anyone in our school can come and have a look, come and try them on. If they don't want them, that's fine. Um, otherwise they just sign a form that they can take them for the night and then bring them back a week later. Principal Grant McMillan says the donations are flooding in. I believe about 150 dresses have come through already, about 30 um, shirts, there's been a dozen and a half suits I think, there's been shoes and other things as well and it looks like over half of those things have come in have also gone out again to families and into students. Sia Lafua Tu'u'au says she's been visiting the shop but hasn't found the right dress yet. I haven't really found a, like my size, so I should be back. I will be back next week to have a look because usually every day there's new stock coming in. Ashley Abalvi says the evening can be quite pricey. Dresses range for anywhere from like I'll say eighty dollars to anywhere to up to five hundred. I know girls have told me about their dress prices, and then shoes are like fifty. Makeup can range from fifty to. 200 so it can get real expensive and I think this is a good opportunity for the ones that don't want to spend as much but still have a good time. Sia Lafua Tu'u'au says this year will be much less stressful than last year. We had to go to different um, wardrobe shops and it was pretty hard but this is like like a closet like school closet where you can just uh, try clothes on and then dress it up so then it doesn't really look similar to anyone wearing it next year. Brenda Paul says the shop is popular with the students and some of her friends. Oh, but this is a nice one. It's really cool. The students will come in here and then they'll go outside and like tell all their friends about like this if people don't know about it. And then they'll like come in and it just gets like really packed in here. And it's like, it's pretty good. Yeah. Have any of your friends found anything good in here and hired one out? Yeah, a few of my friends actually. Like you come in here. And then like, they're like trying and they just like walk out with it and they're like, oh, we're in this the ball. And it's like, that's really cool. About 200 year 12 and 13 students will be at the ball next month. And Mr McMillan says once the night's over, he'll talk to other local high schools to see if a central op shop can be created for students to pick out ball outfits each year. Motehotaka Otiahiahi, Kulora Tupoaho.